Ah, this ticket's just coming. I need to solve this. Now, what is it? Users are still struggling to reach London from Birmingham. Okay, so I need to troubleshoot this. Now, it could be a networking problem. Let me open my PC out in Birmingham, and I'm going to do a ping check to the London web server, which is... Now, let me just look this up. Hang on. It could be one of two. Let's try the first one. No, that's not worked. Um, let me try the second one. It could be this, because they changed the um, IP range recently. So I need to look at 132.100. Well, that's okay. That's great. I'm getting a ping response. Fantastic. You can always rely on ping. We like ping. So now let's do a trace route. But now this is the PC. So is it the trace route command? Or, or is it trace? I think it's trace on the um, PC. So let's do a trace route. Let's find out the hops of the devices here. That's pretty good. So we can see all these hops. And so now what do I need to do next? I think I'm going to log on to this device here, whatever it is. And I'll, I'll look at the first hop and just see what it, what is this. Because if it's Birmingham, it's going to be specific to that site. So how do I do that? So I'm going to open up my trusty friend Putty. And I'm going to open up an SSH session. So that is 172.17.130.1. OK, open. Come on. Oh, typical. I'll try the next one. Hang on. I'll try the next device. 192.168.130.1. Oh, still no good. Whilst that's doing it, I'm going to go back to my first one. Hang on. Oh, this is taking ages. So if I go to the first one, maybe 172.17.130.1, it could be Telnet, couldn't it? Let's try tel oh. Oh. Let's try that one, open. Oh, brilliant. Okay, it was Telnet. So now I need to log in. So let's try admin. I've got some credentials written down here in the back of a um, post-it now. Oh, they're the wrong credentials. Now I need to look up what the right credentials are. Oh, hang on. You're saying I've got NetBrain integration. Oh, well, why didn't you tell me? Because with NetBrain, all I need to do is I need to go into the ticket and I can see all of this information. But then I've got the NetBrain automation tab. And so NetBrain has already, as soon as the ticket was raised, service now here on the ticket, talk to NetBrain and says, NetBrain, could you perform some diagnostics, please? So I can go in here. Let's, let's open this in NetBrain. So this is now taking me straight into NetBrain. And what I can see here, as it's, it's opening a map for me, so what's this showing me? So it's already mapped a path from the source to the destination from Birmingham all the way through to London. This is really, really helpful. And it's already performed some diagnostics for me. So it's done things like checking the route to London. So what was going on here? So if I look here, it's all green. My route's good. My details. Let's have a look. My next hop's all good luck. So this is what it's this is what it should be, and this is what it is. That's all good. Oh, but hang on, I can see something in red. Wait, wait, look here. Birmingham path check. And it's telling me something here. Duplex mismatch. Duplex mismatch detected between Birmingham, switch two, and this other router over here. And actually, if I go in here, it'll actually show me. We have a speed duplex mismatch. So NetBrain has already come in here and it's done some diagnostics. So rather than having to log in, try and find the right passwords, do pings and trace routes, I can go directly in here and it's actually showing me and it's got here, look, value half duplex on this device and actually on the other device it's full duplex. And look at the speed. The speed doesn't match either. We've got it. I've found the problem. So all I need to do now is I can need to go back into my ticket and just update it and say, actually, it's all fixed. So thank you very much, NetBrain.